Hello everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I want to talk about a little bit of issues that I was coming across. After using my printer for a good while, my alcohol started getting real cloudy. And over time I didn't really think about, I, I didn't know how long you can go without cleaning it or when you needed to replace it. And as you can see it's clear, but I was looking around online for solutions for this because the issue was that the alcohol would dry but it would also dry with resin so then I had a, a weird film building up around some of the models and it would, wasn't too big of a deal because I would put a primer in but sometimes it would it would be a little bit more problem than I wanted to deal with when you were printing you don't want to have to deal with cleaning it up at, again with after all the mess what I did was grab a jug and poured the alcohol inside of it with the filter I tried to filter it out as much as I could and put it into the sunlight or a windowsill and left it there for a couple days and it actually cleared it up. This was really cloudy. Whenever you looked through it, you couldn't even see through it. It was really bad and I was just kind of just going with it, just using it and I didn't think much about it until I started seeing parts of my model come out cloudy and a little, little bit of, how do you say it? grungy I guess <laughs> not even grungy it was just just didn't look right even though I painted over it you can still see some of that kind of messing up with the final print this is one of my Wacom pen holders and yeah I got the little velcro on there because I always lose my pen so I I keep the pen on there and I keep the velcro so whenever I have to let go and type I don't put my pen down because I'm always losing my pen so it's just always I don't know small random tip but anyway made one of these because I kept I don't know, I wanted something better than what came with it. It was another one that's over there. Coming back to this, I just wanted to share this with whoever watches these videos, who's doing 3D printing with resins, that if you're running into issues with it printing kind of cloudy, maybe pouring it into a jug of your milk container or something, as long as you can filter it back into there and let it set out in the sun, it'll look real cloudy. It'll look like it won't even work. I didn't even think it would work. I left it in the sun and all the resin just kind of hardened at the bottom of the milk jug and I just poured everything back into here and now I got some cleaner cleaning solution that I can use to probably get uh, better prints in the future. So hopefully this helps. I know it's a short video. I wanted to kind of get this out there because as I'm learning, I just wanted to share what I learned and what I've found online or kind of hand off that it does work, it helps out. These came along with my printer. I probably have to make, you know, I thought about 3D printing something so I could just use that, but these are little throwaway filters that you can use and just pour it in there, pour it back. But I'll, I'll eventually run out of these, so I need to find out a solution that doesn't really make so much waste, I guess, in the end. So yeah, thank you for watching. Hope this little bit was informative and hopefully to post another video soon. Have a good day.